it's Flo and today I want to show you on my HTC One X the last version of MIUI X. This is the version 1.6 and I am using this one because I love to have MIUI with Sense application as the camera for example. So we get there the last version. Uh, we can see different things here with MIUI version 2.1.1 on an ice cream sandwich. So uh, we have to thank uh, the dev for, for that and uh, this is just amazing to, to get this one. We have the Apex Launcher there and we can see the camera for example uh, with the last version there. This is uh, a very cool version there with uh, some smoothness or not there. This is just to save some pictures you can see that and we get it uh, just here and we get some pictures there. So this is just so cool to uh, to get this uh, this version of Android with Sense and MIUI at the same time. Uh, so I will just delete these uh, pictures. So all the camera is working and uh, I want to show you different things. So for example, we get on the lock screen new things. On the lock screen we already have uh, the MIUI to go to the uh, launcher the player there but we have also something we have the remap this button just to unlock the screen by this way you know and there is the lock screen we get also the menu uh, there to uh, to up the sound but we must maybe uh, use the player about the player music this is a new player this is the MIUI player so here we get the MIUI player and not uh, just right now the sense player we get also this search uh, option, this sleep timer, we can use it just to slip down the uh, MIUI audio. We get some settings to download images, for example, with networks to the albums, download lyrics, listen to online music, and download music uh, on when you listen it online, for example, and other options. We also get, uh, for example, if I just play this one, I have to put it there. There is lyrics not found, but if I am uh, using, uh, I don't know, maybe uh, Eminem, because I know Eminem is working, for example, it's searching for lyrics, and we get the lyrics for Eminem, I hope there. And we get also different options for here, for example, for the audio settings. Um, I think you have maybe seen the notification status bar and I just want to to show you that. Okay, so please find the lyrics. No, mm, I'll just show you this one maybe searching for lyrics and you get there. Uh, maybe you have seen on the notification bar different things. The first one is the clock is centered and the second one is different icons are there and this is just switch. So okay, there is a new application on the uh, on this on this custom room. This is the control panel just there, and there we get different personal things, personal tweaks I think, and I want to say this is tweaks. On interface, you can control different look looks. For example, animation will come soon. We have the status bar. You can hide the clock or change the clock position. Centered with icon switch. You must to do a reboot just to switch it. So center it for the clock and switch icons just there. Moreover, you can just switch the and change the carrier logo. For example, I am not using a logo, but I am using just a, a name. This is the label. And my label is, for example, flow. You can just see that there. And we get it if we don't have any notifications. We can custom it. Moreover, very native Android settings. Battery information, for example, you get it. Battery scale and battery level. We get uh, the battery health, the battery voltage, uh, the battery temperature, technology, and time since boot. We get also battery usage. This is as on uh, previous MIUI. We get Miss Keller news, for example, accessibility settings. There, uh, accessibility settings. Calling report, you can just check it and check report SMS, report calling, and other things just there. We also get fun information, usage statistic, and Wi-Fi information. Just to know, usage statistic there, just to know what you are, uh, usage time, launch count, app, and over. Messaging, for example, 44 times, and the time you use it, for example. 
You also get uh, the system control panel for ROM informations, just there. And we get the advanced set for CPU control. You can govern it with different uh, power saver. For example, the interactive, the power save, the on demand, the performance, and others. You also get the maximum and minimum uh, frequency used. You can set on boot uh, just to apply settings automatically after reboot. Okay, what we get also there, we get um, different application. I have installed a lot of things, so that's why uh, I am looking for. There is navigation, there is different sense ROG application, Play Store, the sense phone. Uh, there is also the theme because we have we get the Apex and MIUI. So there is the MIUI theme with local online that you can just uh, uh, download. So maybe you have to use it. You have also the mix just to use different uh, different options. For example, uh, you have already seen that on my previous video. Um, I think I have say a lot of things about this custom ROM and I use it for my daily usage because this is my favorite one. So thanks to have seen this video, just let me some comments, just thumbs up if you like it also and just uh, send me what you want to know about this custom ROM. Thanks to have seen this video, that was Flo.